I say, one of the most beautiful views in Australia. Hey, good morning guys. So we have a pretty exciting day in store today. We're actually heading out to the Great Barrier Reef and I'm pretty nervous because I'm doing something I've actually never done before. We're going scuba diving on the reef as well as a bit of snorkeling. So just a few quick um, facts about the Great Barrier Reef. It actually stretches about 2300 kilometers down the coast. It's composed of about 2900 reefs and eight or 900 islands, which is pretty crazy. It's actually the only living thing that can be seen from space, which is pretty mad. So the Great Barrier Reef is actually a natural um, uh, world heritage site, as well as one of the natural wonders of the world, which is pretty cool. How are you feeling, Adela, about going diving today? I'm really excited, but I have butterflies in my tummy. <laughs> Yeah, me too. <laughs> We're just filling out our medical questionnaire for diving. from our um, circling and scuba diving experience and that was the most surreal experience I have had in my life. You literally felt like you were in another world, which I guess we were. How did you it enjoy that? It was amazing. I thought that was something I would never do in my life, but it was such a rewarding experience. I really enjoyed it. Speaking of accomplishments, we actually got certificates on the completion of our first scuba dive, which is pretty cool. For a full-on day of snorkeling and diving, we're absolutely starving now, gonna go head out for dinner. And apparently Cairns is known for their Southeast Asian cuisine, so we thought we might go try some Balinese cuisine tonight.
of a spear easy is an easy way of making a full prong spear or you'd actually carve your your prongs maybe about that long out mm -hmm. of kangaroo shin bone yeah. okay mm -hmm. or the black palm black palm was another really strong timber yeah. and normal potatoes grow underground mm. these ones grow on the vine collected white flowers we can go hunting for scrub turkey eggs yeah. Coranda come to a store called the 70 year old hippie just gonna get a pretty cool tie and dye shirt here <laughs> thank you <laughs> this has been a very interesting day the 70 year old hippie just gave me a free shirt because apparently he likes Canadians there you go but it is pretty hot so I think we're gonna go find some waterfalls and creeks to try and have a swim in as we can't really swim on the beach in Cairns due to the risk of some crocs and stingers so let's go find some waterfalls we just got to the Babinda boulders which we're gonna go check out now don't think I'll be going for a swim here as we just saw a few snakes yeah, through the water. So <laughs> might move on to the next spot after this one. towards Josephine Falls in Wurunurun National Park and yes that word does have six O's just went in for a swim and that was very refreshing but oh my god that was freezing <laughs> 